What is up, YouTube? Today, I want to share my morning routine and, you know, maybe help you guys develop a morning routine because when I was still in school, I didn't have a morning routine, you know, every day was a mess. Waking up late, eating late, getting dressed late, being late for school. It just wasn't beneficial or good at all, you know, it, and once you start off, start off your day with, with that, you know, it's just going to be a shit day. So... When I started to work, I realized I don't have time to gym in the afternoon, nor do I have the strength or uh, anything to really gym in the afternoon. So to me, I, I knew I had to start working out in the morning. And for that to happen every morning, I knew I needed to have a routine setting that I can follow. And I mean, it's really a simple routine. I'll take you guys through it. It's really simple. Now you don't need to complicate things for yourself so my morning starts at 5 a.m 5 a.m i wake up i get dressed i get a cup of coffee in go to the toilet because i need to every day after that gym so to get a that, that's basically the morning routine so to get a bit more in depth 5 a.m wake up get dressed it's about 10 past five i mean I just take a, a, a shirt, underwear, pants, shoes, that's it. Get my cup of coffee in, at this time it's half past, hit the toilet, it's 20, 20 to 6, to, uh, quarter to 6, in the car, on my way to gym. And, uh, and I'm normally there at 10 or 5 to 6, I'm at the gym already, warming up, working out. Then, I gym about an hour hour and 20 minutes so 10 past 7 I'm done head back home take my little sister to school come back it's about 20 past um, my mother makes me a breakfast two toasts uh, two pieces of toast bread with three to four eggs depending on the day depending how hungry I am after I've eaten it's about half past uh, seven and basically then until five to eight I'm, I'm chilling, you know, I don't need to do anything, I can, you know, sit down, see what's happening on the news, check on crypto, you know, all these things, you know, the, and I think that is the important thing. Once you start off your day like that without needing to rush to work, to rush to school, things just tend to go a whole lot better because I know I need to get some certain things done, done in the morning. I need to make my bed. I need to eat, get that protein in. I need to make sure everything is right. Make, my, make sure my fish are right, my dog's right. So, yeah, it's it's really simple. Again, I don't I don't sleep eight hours every night. I don't think it's possible for anyone to get eight hours of sleep every single night. You know, sometimes I've got work to do. Sometimes I have to work out at night. Sometimes I need to finish some work. Sometimes I want to watch a movie. Right, sometimes I need to fish, clean the fish, whatever, you know, so I don't, I, I tend to get six to seven hours of sleep every night. That's about my range and uh, I'm quite fine with it. So, yeah, just, I saw so many TikTok videos of how certain people get ready in the morning. And I just think to myself, there's no way people can believe this. No one does this morning routine. And uh, that's, that's basically what I want to say that you don't need a, you don't need to wake up two, three hours before work to get things done. You know, you don't. It's not necessary. But I think if you don't work out, waking up maybe, you know, an hour and a half to two hours before work is definitely going to definitely going to be beneficial for you. You know, if you get up, get dressed, get your cup of coffee in, go to the toilet, brush your teeth eat you have like an hour hour and a half left no okay like an hour you have like an hour left where you can make your bed you know prepare food for for the rest of the day you know pack your food in um you tend uh, one thing i did notice is you you tend to forget things less like sometimes when i brush to work i you know i forget my phone i forget my charger my keys I forget my food, my water, something. But when you are early and it's like and it's like half an hour before work and you can be like, okay, my phone, I have it. My keys, I have it. My water in my bag, I have it. Fruit, I have it. My key, I have it. 
cool, everything is sorted and you can go on your time. You don't need to rush. I mean, doesn't that sound better to anyone? I think, I just think it, it's, it's really simple or you can make it a lot more simpler, more simple than what it really is. So again, yeah, I just wanted to say, share my morning routine with you guys and uh, you know, maybe help you guys develop a morning routine because I, I, I have noticed it's beneficial a lot because sometimes I'd even miss breakfast. I know so many people who miss breakfast you know, and at work, they can't work, they can't concentrate, they feel ill. And uh, it really does start with that breakfast in the morning. So, basically, to, to uh, end this video, do develop a morning routine, even if it's just an hour before work, two hours before work. Just try it even for a week, and I promise you, it will help you tremendously. You do not need eight hours of sleep. Don't quote me on that, though, but, yeah, I think... Once you really work, you know, side hustles, news, all these things, you can't get eight hours of sleep every night, and that's fine. You only live once, so enjoy living it. Anyway, guys, thank you for tuning in. Take care and peace. I'm out.